There's another red. Fur Life is proudly sponsored by Uncle Freddy's Gut Glove, The Buck Cage, Comstock Custom Cages, Dust to Dawn Bow Fishing, Twister Knock, All Blade, Smokey's Deer Lures, Trip Away Outdoors. Mountain View Guide Service, Pennsylvania Arrow Company, Field Rests, Creation Wildlife Supplements, Bow Dagger, Outdoor Access, and Frigid Forage. Dig in the dirt. No, really, dig in the dirt. See the possibilities. Use a tractor. Use your muscles. Break the ground. Break a sweat. Load up. It's time to get the seed in the ground. Don't forget to pray for rain. See it sprout. Watch it grow. Hunt. Harvest. Nobody does food plot seed like frigid forage. On this episode of Fur Life, Brian Flowers and his pro staff take you deep into the mountains of West Virginia, turkey hunting. Well, I recovered my bird. 
I got that Jeb's headhunter choke on here. Man, I tell you what, these things are deadly. Anyway, this bird, he probably, uh, I'd say he's got a nine inch beard. Not too bad, not bad bird. Two year old. And he's probably uh, maybe three quarter to inch spurs. But uh, what, an, what a hunt. I mean, uh, he come down this uh, right away right here and he attacked this this decoy, this Jake decoy. I mean, him and his buddy, they just tore him up, beat him up bad until they knocked him to the ground. And then I figured, well, it's time to put one of them down. So I got one down. I'm gonna collect this stuff. I'm gonna head to the house and call my son, Jeremy, and let him know that we got another one. Thank you. Right here he is. Same back there. Yep, there he comes. There's four of them. Should we put our face mask on? That one's a cobbler. Yes. It's got a rope. Which one? The one, the one all the way on the left. The one all the way to the right's a cobbler too.
me and killed just we killed two turkeys today. It's the end of the season, and we've been watching these turkeys. And we just come up here. We're in the blind turtle. We just come up here on a whim. I had the decoys out, and I mean this is the last day, absolute last day. What do you do? We just went out, put our decoys out, climbed in the blind turtle. We were here what, Kelch? Half hour, forty five minutes. A little soft calling. These two strutters come in. There's actually still two hens out here, and this gobbler's still flopping around. Man. almost feels like I'm cheating. Let's see what we got. <laughs> no baby. Those are some hooks. Well over inch and a half. Good turkey. I tell you, when he was coming in, just look at that tail fan. Crazy, crazy tail fan. Good beard. Probably nine, nine inches long, thick. But this right here is what we were after. Those are hooks. <laughs> Limb hangers, call them what you want. Well over inch and a half. Probably one of the nicest set of spurs I've ever taken, ever. And to have Kelch behind the camera, awesome hunt. I don't know where I hit this turkey yet, but I think wherever it was at, I crushed him. I absolutely crushed him. Awesome, awesome hunt. Still kind of cool out. We've had this cool spell, but geez, those are hooks.
It ain't the prettiest time I've ever laid down. It's still pretty dark. But I've been on these birds day after day after day after day. I knew where they were roosting, but they always had hens. And uh, finally, every morning before school I'd come up here, they'd just gobble, 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 gobble. Well, a hen flew down not 10 yards from me. Same thing happened yesterday morning. I just backed out of here and didn't even do anything. This morning, they're just gobbling, gobbling, gobbling. There's birds gobbling everywhere. We finally got out of this stretch where it's 90 degrees. and I just smoked one of these birds that's been giving me fits. Absolute fits. I've had these birds at 3, 25, 50, 45 yards, 100 and 125 times. And I've heard these birds gobble over a thousand times and they just wouldn't work. So I slid right in here to their bedroom and... He's not even going to get to eat breakfast, so let's go see what we got. Well, folks, finally, finally, finally got it done. I've been hunting so, so hard, getting up before school every morning. Just the weather's been crazy. It's been 90, 9. Well, finally, we get it done here. Uh, we've had a little dry spell since our last bird, and... I finally got in here. These birds have been roosting in the same spot for basically a week and a half. And I'd get close, but no cigar. I finally got in here before school. I roosted them last night. I pretty much knew what tree they were in. The hen flew down 10 yards from me. And when I was uh, root. Well, here he is, good two-year-old turkey. I've been fighting this turkey and his uh, probably brother for about a week and a half. They've been roosting the same spot, but they just didn't want to work. The weather's been absolutely horrible, around 90 degrees, and they just, as soon as they hit the ground, they've been shutting down. We did hear some more birds this morning. I think it's because of the thunderstorms last night, and I didn't do anything but scout. That's how this bird got killed. I knew what trees they were in. The hen actually flew down 10 yards from me. I was getting ready to film them gobble on the roost a little bit more and I had the camera arm pushed down so when she flew down I actually had to adjust that before I made the shot. I didn't think it was going to happen. He walked in right behind her and his brother was right behind him. Uh, it was a little bit dark but it was plenty enough light to see and I wasn't going to let this bird pass me again. Dig in the dirt. No really, dig in the dirt. See the possibilities. Use a tractor. Use your muscles. Break the ground. Break a sweat. Load up. It's time to get the seed in the ground. Don't forget to pray for rain. See it sprout. Watch it grow. Hunt. Harvest. Nobody does food plot seed like frigid forage. Fur Life is proudly sponsored by Uncle Freddy's Gut Glove. The Buck Cage, Comstock Custom Cages, Dust to Dawn Bow Fishing, Twister Knock, All Blade, Smokey's Deer Lures, Trip Away Outdoors, Mountain View Guide Service. Pennsylvania Arrow Company Field Rests Creation Wildlife Supplements Bow Dagger Outdoor Access and Frigid Forage